Turkey will start testing the engine it is buying from Ukraine to power its T-929 ATAK-2 twin-engine heavy attack helicopter this year. In a New Year's greeting for employees working at Turkish Aerospace Industries, Thai, General Manager Temel Kotil revealed the progress of various projects undertaken by the company. He announced that the 11-ton helicopter will start its engine and rotate its propellers in 2022. The helicopter will be equipped with 2,500 horsepower turboshaft engines and will make its flight in 2023. Kotil had previously announced that the engines for the ATA K2 would come from Ukraine. A contract for 14 TV3 to 117 engines has already been signed with Motor Sitch. ATA K2 will carry 1500 kg of ammunition. It will have nearly twice the takeoff weight than the current ATA K rotorcraft. The helicopter can be tasked with air to ground combat, air to air combat, armed reconnaissance surveillance, and close air support CAS, operations. It will incorporate some subsystems and components developed under T129 and the T625 Gokbi helicopter projects. The T929 helicopter features tandem seats, asymmetrical weapons bay, high ammunition capacity, low infrared, IR, signature, digital cockpit, ballistic protection, improved avionics, electronic warfare and countermeasure capability. The helicopter will be fitted with a nose-mounted forward-looking infrared, FLIR, turret that includes target tracking functionality. The helicopter will also feature electronic warfare systems such as infrared ultraviolet missile warning sensors and a tail-mounted directed infrared countermeasure DIRCM, system to jam heat-seeking missiles. The heavy class attack helicopter project was launched to meet the needs of the Turkish armed forces in this field. 